Hey guys, what's up? Multi PS3 Game here again, and welcome back to another M Creator video. Today we are doing an update video, well, just for M Creator in general. Uh, the latest version has just came out. It is M Creator 1.7.1, and this update was uh, mainly for the mob and user interface update, um, as it does say right here. Um, and if you want a full list of what it added entirely, I will go ahead and leave a link down. In the description for the change log, uh, it's actually really cool. I really like the new design and interface of M Creator. I think they made it a lot easier for a lot of uh, beginning mod creators. Um, it, it just they made it a lot easier, and it, it just appeals to more people. Um, that is a better appeal. So the first thing is the workspace. As you can tell, right here. On all the items except for the armor they have added the icon that your item is or what it looks like um, it's black and white there's no color um, black white and gray which is totally fine it's still really cool how they did that so with my with my official Crusaders mod I have the vibranium the black iron and all my cloth and everything here and they have a picture of what it looks like so instead of like going around looking for what you're trying to find, uh, if you have over 180 elements to your mod, almost 200 like me, um, it made it a lot easier. Then again, there is a search bar up here where you can go and search for vibranium, but they made it a lot easier so you don't have to search anymore. All you have to do is just look for the picture. Um, and if you know where your mob or your item has been created in the... Um, the list uh, you can just go ahead and scroll down there and you'll be able to find it uh, so that was an easy thing that they did or made it a lot easier for people uh, the second thing that they've done is they have updated the crap out of mobs now a lot of people have questions about mobs and how they work um, how you add your own AI and I made a video, I tried to explain it as best as possible. I think I did a pretty good job. Um, sometimes M Creator is the mob, the older version, the mob um, creation was just all messed up and it was basically impossible to do. Um, so, in this update, they've updated the way for you to create a mob uh, and they've added a lot of new options that originally you had to actually code to get it to work. So. Uh, let's go ahead and create a mob. We are going to name it Billy Bob the Mob. That's okay. And the first thing you can see is they actually have a new layout for how uh, the first part of creating the mob. So it's, it's a little bit different. Um, I think it's helpful in a way uh, that you can see stuff more. Uh, and they've added a new way to import a texture. You can import textures that you've already uh, have from other mobs. Uh, so your resources in game, or you could just, you know, get it from your computer or make it on MC Skin 3D, which they have updated the MC Skin 3D textures to it should work now. Uh, in the past versions, it breaks and it doesn't work. So. I looked and it said that it's fixed and it's working fine with M Creator. Uh, if it's not, well, well, that's not really my fault. Uh, they still need to fix it, but so far it works. But I already have a skin that I'd like to use. We're gonna do the Doge skin and the mob models. Well, they have all the uh, regular models. We're gonna do Biped because we want it to look like a person, and we don't have a Doge skin set for any other kinds of these mobs we want it to be a creature uh, and then we want the spawn egg to look like so 
And then we'll name it Billy Bob the Mob. Next. Name a mob. Billy Bob the Mob. Uh, we want it to be a creature. Attack strength, we'll have it as six. Um, movement speed, we'll do 1.38, just because. Uh, and the equipment, what you want it to hold. So equipment optional, for the, so the first one is your main hand. Second one is the left hand. Uh, so this is right, this is the left hand. Uh, this is the helmet, chest plate, leggings, and the boots. So we're going to want them. Let's have Doge wear. Let's have him wear an Iron Man chest plate. Health will do 500, and it's immune to fire. Uh, so the first one's mob drop, so what it drops normally. So we'll want it to drop a grass block. And then for a rare drop, we'll have it drop a vibranium fragment. Uh, experience amount, well, we'll do 32. Uh, living sound, oh, let's just, let's just pick an elder guardian ambient sound. Uh, and then when it gets hurt, we'll do a donkey and then the death sound we'll do we'll do the end music uh, particles we don't want any particles spawning from our mob but we could so you know what we'll do some particles um, we'll do critical magic uh, spread We'll increase this to one particle amount. We'll increase that to six. Particle spawning conditions always, because that's the only condition. Uh, when struck by lightning, we won't do anything when mob falls. Nothing when killed. Nothing when mob attacks. Nothing. Uh, when right click that mob, we'll do nothing for that. So has AI. Um, don't use this with the flying mobs, as it may cause recom recompilation errors. Um, so has AI. Uh, we don't want it to have a boss thing, uh, and if we right click on it, the new feature is we want it to ride the mob. Uh, select if this mob is breedable, if checked, specify breed trigger items, this requires an AI task enabled, AI base or behavior base will be ignored if you do this. Oh, okay, so if you want it to where your mob can breed, this won't matter and you're going to have to pick one of these, I think is what it's saying. Um, but if you don't want it to breed, then just leave this unchecked. I'm going to leave this unchecked because I don't want it to breed. Uh, actually. Actually, no. We, we don't want it to breed. I don't want Doge to breed. The, the breathe. I meant breed. Uh, select if you'd like to your mob to be able to do ranged attacks. If you would like this mod will attack other entities with ranged attacks. At least one act aggressively against AI tests. So you need at least one um, uh, a task saying that it's going to attack aggressively against this mob. Um, I think this is the item it shoots out if it has a ranged attack. So act aggressively against, let's do a pig. So there's a lot of new things that it can attack. There's a pig. Am I completely passing it? Oh, there it is. And Teddy Pig. And Titty Pig. Oh, frick. Let's do something. Titty Pig. Ten. Want to wander. Put that as seven. Leap at target. Three. 
and that's all we'll do for the AI. Um, spawn pro probability will leave at 20, minimal number of mobs 3, maximum number of mobs will do 15. Uh, only that specific biome, no, we'll have it spawn all over the place. Does spawn in dungeons? Sure, why not? Alright, I'm going to let that recompile, and I'll be right back in game. Alrighty, so we are back in game. Um, oh, I already see Billy Bob's over here. Oh, Billy Bob's drowning. He has the Iron Man Mark 46 chest plate. And you can see all the particles around them. And let's. Oh, oh, I already see a dead pig. Oh, I can't. Yeah, he's killing him. He's shooting the eggs. Uh, let's just spawn. Let's just spawn a couple of pigs. Just a couple. So, like I said, just a couple of them. And we'll spawn a couple of Billy Bobs. And, uh. Have at it, Mr. Billy Bob. Go crazy! I think we need some more Billy Bobs. Ah! Oh, I'm riding him. I'm riding Billy Bob. Let's go, Billy Bob. Come on, Billy Bob. I'm stuck in a tree. Hi there. Alright. Well, as you can tell, the mob is working perfectly. Uh, and good job, uh, M Creator. The new update was very, very well done with the mobs. Uh, they're working, and that's what everybody wanted. They wanted the mobs to be working, and they're finally working. I don't think they're very happy with each other. Alright, so that's going to do it for this M Creator update video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And like always, if you guys have any questions about the update, you can either ask myself or you can check out the change log. Uh, that will be down in the description. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see more of this, make sure you smash that like button. And like always, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.